send the laundry at the mail. I only have a few minutes. It doesn't take her long. Trust me. So, I think and probably you men don't like that I'm always talking about um, that, I'm, that the only thing I ever talk about is my horrible experiences with men. Well, that's the way it goes. I don't care if I can care if you don't like it. Okay? It's the truth. <laughs> it's always the truth. It's also the truth that I don't go around thinking that all men are horrible. I don't think that. I think I've, I've, I've been unlucky, you know. I don't go around thinking that, but it doesn't matter anyway. Because I'm all messed up. And it doesn't matter what you, what you think or what you think or how, who you would It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't fucking matter. So here's another uh, little tidbit. Like I said, when I was not with Donald anymore, but still living under his good graces as mom, um, but not as, you know, during my girlfriend anymore, I got involved in the Craigslist ads and all kinds of stuff, you know, just to do something, just to not feel like the, the biggest loser out there, you know? Um... And I had an ad where I wanted to just dance with someone, and I, we went to Spotlight Bar with this guy, and um, and he he wanted to dance, so you know we had a good time dancing. Um, but he, I wasn't expecting him to buy me drinks. He couldn't even afford his own drinks, and he was bitching about the cost of the drinks. I'm like, and then after that we were walking back, so I take the bus home. I took the buses there, bus home, whatever, and he started turning into, you know, we'd had fun dancing at Spotlight Bar, and then he turned into, you know, something else, and turned into a completely different person, started, and red flag, red flag, red flag. Now, up until then, I, I wasn't mad, head over heels, attracted to him, but I could have been attracted to him if he was a different person, see? Physically, he was okay, he was pleasant enough, but he turned into a jerk. And started like, just ripping his ex apart and all this crap and trying to make excuses why he couldn't afford to buy his own drinks and had to bitch about the... I, 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 I'm not expecting you to buy me drinks, but I'm expecting you to be, at least be afford to buy your own without bitching. To buy more than one drink. You were supposed to drink with me a little bit, not have me be drinking it. You know, it just... Anyhow. But this, we had a good time dancing and then he turned into a fucking asshole. So, just making it. That was yet another fucking asshole, you know. And he was saying some bad things. And, and I'm like, you don't say that to somebody you just met. You think I'm going to sit here and tell you all about Donald and how abusive he was towards me when we just are meeting today? No. He started saying awful things about his ex. And I'm like, red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag. And I never wanted to see him again. And then he started not being happy about that, that I had the nerve to not want to see him again. It'll just look like I'm, I'll throw the camera in the thing like I've done before. I shall never know. And then I'm just emptying the dishwasher and listening to my music. If all I've had is these repeated bad experiences with men. But it doesn't mean I'm not still attracted to men. It doesn't mean I think all men are horrible. It means that I know you can't know. People trick you. Men trick you. They trick you and they trick you and they trick you. And you cannot know up front. I don't give a fuck what anyone says. It's the truth. And it really always all boils down to my lot in life. See, if I had a better lot in life, it would be different. It'd be far, far different. Come and whisper in my ear. Don't worry, I'm drinking. Ouch. Okay. 
says, I don't know why Kourtney Kardashian, and um, but she puts up with that shit. She's fucking has all everything, and then she puts up with being treated like total shit. I've been treated like total shit too much. I won't tolerate it at all. But unfortunately, you can't know up front. I've learned that the hard way, repeatedly. an absolute blast dancing with that guy at Spotlight like Bar. A blast. Despite not being like, like mega physically attracted to him, I was attracted to him enough that if he had been, you know, he turned out to be yet another asshole. Sometimes she stops and chats that she's gone a little bit longer. She said she wasn't going to be gone. She just wanted to get them back.
You shun man, and I say that you're full of shit. And I say that you fall in love, shit. <laughs> Next song that comes out, do you want to touch me? I did that at karaoke on Spotify. My trademark first, the first time I did Delta Dawn. That's like my trademark song because it's easy. I know it like the back of my hand. But yeah, I'd found a guy and he loved to dance. It was a miracle. And we danced up a storm. I met him through Craigslist ad, my own. I made my own things happen. I wanted to dance, wanted to find a guy to dance with me. Um. I think we went in the daytime. No, we didn't go in the daytime. No, I don't know. He just turned out to be a jerk. Remember, I was just trying to, I was on welfare. I was in the lowest point of ever, okay? I was trying to do anything just to feel better about myself, about life, about people. And I had Donald and Hope there, and I just was nothing. But I could get all dolled up and go out, and even, I mean, I, I very limited on money. I wasn't expecting this guy to buy me drinks, and I wasn't going to, I didn't spend a fortune on, you know what I mean? But when he's bitching and can't even afford his own fucking drink, I think because he likes to drink an expensive drink, and, oh, I can't even afford to buy another one, oh my god, I can't take it. Red flag, red flag. Remember, Donald was a cheap selfish, in and out of bed, abusive towards me, bastard. You cannot have any money and still not be like the way he was, okay? I'm frugal. I have to be. I have no money. But Donald was just an asshole all around. He'd be an asshole if he had money. I'm telling you. Anyhow.